Um, I played the main antagonist of the movie, Killer Clown. He is an evil entity um, as such who says he's on the search for truth and he will get it by any means necessary. He spends a lot of the film physically and mentally terrorizing people. Um, a lot of it was spent adjusting to um, wearing a mask because obviously you can't see a lot of the facial expressions so a lot of it was finding the correct voice and the vocal inclinations to tell, get across like what I wanted the character to convey, a lot of eye movements and also the posture because obviously you're going to be focusing a lot more on that because the face is just this horrifying clown mask essentially. Um, it was a lot of fun. Um, the great thing about Reggie, um, which I'm sure other people have said, is his clarity of vision. He knows what he wants, um, and when he tells you the story, like when he initially told me about it, he tells you with such enthusiasm that it comes into you, yourself, and then when you turn up there and you're in costume, that enthusiasm engulfs you and you want to be part of the project and just give the best points you can. So it was a lot of fun. Um, I got to meet new people. I worked with um, kids or other people who were 10 and I think 16 for the first time, which was an interesting experience. So yeah, I learned a lot and gained a lot. Anarchy, everything is perfectly, well not perfectly fine, but a lot calmer and mellow until Killer Clown enters this movie. And even then, um, regardless of the outcome, you can still feel the consequences of his actions afterwards. Um, I particularly, that was one of the things that drew me to this, because um, growing up, you know, I've been a lot into my comic books, my Marvel movies, even before there was the big MCU they are today, and most of those things were predominantly not melanin actors or black actors like me, we were very much put into these brackets of you can be a hood film, you can be a slave film, or you can be about music and so on. So I thought it was very important to have something of this, of knowing that we can expand into different genres at different levels. So it doesn't just have to be the MCU movies, it can be the low level indie things or the mid budget things and so on. Technically, I may have lost, but at the end, brothers are split apart. I'm still lurking out there somewhere, so I'll take it as, I think Reggie's, they won the battle. They did not necessarily win the war. <laughs> I mean, I'd like to think I'm quite important because the legacy and the Reggie's wouldn't have anything to fight without me there. So yeah, I feel it as the main antagonist. Pretty important. <laughs> In a heated debate, YR, the entertainer, defeated the now former UK leader, resulting in her resignation of her title. Tonight they will fall, and I will rise. Mr. YR, I place the bomb in this garage. You have about one minute to return to your room, or I will blow up the entire building. Nowhere to run, YR. An evil clown has captured my brothers and holding them hostage. Woo! I need your help. Woo! Time to have some fun. <laughs> Woo! Woo! I'll take the matter into my own hands Woo! and put away YR and his brothers for good. Woo! Why are you here? Thor versus Killer Clown.